believe the next 20 years will be very good for farmland because more and more people, less land, and we're more and more concerned about what we're eating. Therefore, the end play there, the more there is inflation, the end play goes down to the farmland, right? Eventually, the inflation makes its way down to the farmland. It starts at the dinner table, it makes its way down the supply chain, and eventually the land that is producing this corn, this wheat, this canola will start to appreciate value. Now, there's no operating risk. We don't want to be running farms. We simply want to own the underlying asset, rent it back to the farmer, reduce the risk, and just collect the distribution for renting the land. And that's a way that you can participate as a Canadian investor. You can participate in farmland.